consistently spending time in prayer. Remembering prayer is a conversation. You know, it's both speaking to God and, and also listening to God and, and hearing what He has to say through the power of His Holy Spirit. The only way I'm going to be able to run a 5K in, in another year is for me to, to continue running on a regular basis. The only way Peyton Manning and, and the Colts are going to be able to, to consistently come through in those clutch situations when, when the pressure is on is because they've done the work on the practice field of, of going over the plays and, and understanding where everyone's going to be moving and, and doing and, and how he, he's going to be, be passing the, the ball. You know, the only way we're going to be strong enough to stand firm in the face of adversity is to to practice spiritual consistency day by day. You can't get in shape for the big game on the day, on the morning of the game. You must live consistently in Christ today in, to be ready to pass the test tomorrow. So what are you doing to invest in your spiritual life today that you can stand strong in the face of adversity? Let us pray. Lord, we must confess that there are so many distractions that, that keep us from investing in our spiritual life as, as you would desire. But Lord, help us to, to live consistently and, and faithfully day by day in, in the little decisions. So that when the storms of, of life come, so when we face days of adversity, we can stand strong and dependent upon you. Through Christ our Lord we pray. Amen.